After a long time, we are finally getting the next part in the Mad Max franchise. Morality. Justice. Mercy. It is titled Friosa and will serve as a prequel as well as spin-off. Critics and fans of the series have already dubbed it the most anticipated film of 2024. If you have seen its previous part, then you know why emotions are turning high for this film. A lot of people are wondering about this upcoming action-adventure movie and its storyline. That's why this Tinny Wizard is here, your ultimate guide to Hollywood films and TV shows. Taught it took a hero to change things. We never got it. For those who might not know, Mad Max is a legendary film series. It is created by the brilliant minds of George Miller and Byron Kennedy. It all started back in 1979 with the first film simply titled Mad Max. Made with a budget of only 400k, it earned more than 100 million dollars at the box office. Thus, its success kicked off an epic journey. Since then, we have been treated to three more amazing parts in this series. We got the second part in 1981, which is known as The Road Warrior. It was also a major success and gained favorable reviews. The third part, Beyond Thunderdome, was released in 1985. However, it was the critically acclaimed Fury Road, which took the world by storm in 2015. The last part of the series is still hailed as one of the best action films ever made. The impact of this franchise on pop culture is absolutely insane, especially when it comes to anything apocalyptic. I awaited. We are talking about a world where resources are scarce and society is on the brink of collapse. This kind of stuff surely keeps us on the edge of our seats. Now there's a new film on the horizon and it is called Mad Max Furiosa. The upcoming action flick is taking us on a journey to explore the origins of Imperator Furiosa. It was one of the most pivotal characters from the 2015 film and it was played by the talented Charles Theron. Remember me? In Fury Road, we first meet her when she was serving as the logistics mastermind for the fearsome in Modern Joe. She was handling the transportation of oil from gas town to the citadel, but this fierce woman has her own agenda. She rebels against a Modern Joe to rescue the five wives and stands up for what she believes in. This movie makes her a true feminist icon in the franchise. Critics from all over the world have showered this character with praise. The character has become a symbol of strength and empowerment. It definitely proves that female action heroes can rock the big screen. Now the whole new chapter is coming which revolves around this badass woman. So let's talk about this upcoming prequel and what can we expect from it. You hear that? We're gonna see two airborne V8s. Let's do it. In this upcoming installment, we'll be following Furiosa after she's been kidnapped from the green place of many mothers. She finds herself in a biker hood, led by formidable warlord Dementus. Together they will cross the treacherous wasteland and eventually stumble upon the infamous citadel. This place is ruled by a modern Joe, so a clash between these two warlords will be imminent. However, we all know where our heroine ends up in Fury Road. Nevertheless, the journey to get there is going to be one heck of a roller coaster. Three thousand gallons of gasoline, just like you asked. Despite the harsh and ruthless nature of the wasteland, she remains true to her morals and stands tall to protect those around her. She's a true force to be reckoned with. The movie promises to be even more epic than the previous part. We all remember that the 2015 movie was one wild road trip. Well, this prequel is taking it to a whole new level. We also have its official synopsis which reads, As the world fell, young Furiosa is snatched from the green place of many mothers and falls into the hands of the great biker hood led by the war 
are large dementors sweeping to the wasteland. They come across the citadel presided over by the immortal Joe. While the two tyrants war for dominance, Furiosa must survive many trials as she puts together the means to find her way home. Leading the charge is the talented Anya Tyler Joy. She is said to play the young Imperator Furiosa. Alongside her, we have a major MCU star, which is none other than the Chris Hemsworth. It is reported that he will be playing the villain Dementus. According to the reports, there were some changes in the cast along the way. Yaya Abdul Mateen II was initially on board, but due to scheduling conflicts, he had to step back. Now Tom Burke has been cast in Yaya's place. Some familiar faces from the previous movie are also returning to it. Nathan Nathan Jones and Angus Sampson will be reprising their roles as Richard's Erectus in The Organic Mechanic. The mastermind behind the franchise, George Miller, is back in the director's chair for this upcoming film. Not only that, but he's also co-producing the movie alongside Doug Mitchell. The whole crew that made Fury Road a blockbuster success is back on board for this part. Nicola Thoris has written the script while the Oscar winner Margaret Sixel is handling the editing section. The brilliant production designer Colin Gibson and the sound mixer Ben Osma are also back in action. Simon Duggan is handling the cinematography once again. The film is being produced by Village Roadshow Pictures and Warner Bros. will be bringing it to the cinemas. The principal photo Photography for this movie kicked off on 1st June 2022. It was set to wrap up by September of the same year. However, the cameras kept rolling and the hard work continued until 28th October 2022, when filming officially wrapped. After that, it entered into post-production for extensive editing. Now, it has been scheduled to hit big screens on 24th May 2024. What a lovely day! So are you excited to see this highly anticipated film? Tell us in the comment section and keep watching this cine visit for more updates.